In February 2016, in a side street of the Mayor, the Stock Exchange building was being prepared for renovation works. This building was originally constructed in 1532 during Antwerp's glory years. During the archaeological excavation of the site, archaeologists discovered remnants of walls, hearths, water and waste pits from medieval structures that were demolished and expropriated in 1532 to make way for the new Stock Exchange building. They then encountered a medieval grey plough layer, a remnant from the period when this location was still outside the city and used as agricultural land. Next, they made a spectacular discovery. Beneath the medieval layer, they found two urns that had survived the ravages of time despite being damaged by medieval ploughs. Scientific dating revealed that the graves are 3,000 years old. The burnt bones in the two urns were determined to belong to an adult man and woman, both buried around 1000 BC. Due to the poor state of the bone remains, very little is known about the man. Physical anthropological examination of the remains of the woman indicates that she was between 20 and 40 years old. It seems quite possible that both individuals were buried around the same time. Nothing is currently known about the possible familial or marital relationship between the man and the woman. This could be clarified through DNA research, but genetic analysis of such old bones is not always successful. It is plausible that both belong to the same group or community, with a shared burial ground. This discovery sheds new light on an older finding. In the 80s, a primitive, handmade pot was discovered under the nearby St. Jan Birchman's College, located approximately 220 meters from the Stock Exchange building. This pot could also be a Bronze Age urn. This hypothesis suggests that the burial site covered a significant area, providing insights into the size of the settlement. Determining whether the settlement can be considered a core settlement or consisted of dispersed homesteads around communal lands remains unclear, as the subsequent history of the city has largely erased the traces. However, evidence of settlement structures has been found on the outskirts of the city. In Dern Extelar, archaeologists discovered the remains of several residential farms from the Bronze Age, Iron Age, and Gallo-Roman period. This suggests that it is possible that there has also been continuous habitation in Antwerp since the burial of the man and the woman 3,000 years ago. What we do know for sure is that following Julius Caesar's conquest of the region in 57 BC, a Gallo-Roman settlement emerged in the 2nd century AD. This settlement was located in the area that would later evolve into Antwerp over the course of the following centuries.